bro starts as a mild mild viral infection like a running nose or a fever and later the child starts having a loud barking cough that is a, one of the characteristic features a loud barking cough a hoarse voice and noisy breathing as the disease progresses if it is not treated in the second stage the child would have a labored breathing and we can see retractions in the chest if it is still not treated in the final stages the child would be fatigued and agitated croup needs to be differentiated from other conditions the most common is a foreign body aspiration aspiration meaning that a foreign body which could be a food matter or a toy a marble something small has got lodged in the air passages that also produces similar symptoms in addition epiglottitis which is a infection of the epiglottis can also produce similar symptoms however the child will be more sick and will have fever bacterial tracheitis is another condition which produces a loud cough there again the child will be having fever diphtheria used to be one of the common causes of a loud barking cough however with the advent of vaccination and almost universal immunization it is no longer seen or seen very rarely most common causes of croup are the para influenza virus 1 2 3 Crew is also caused by in influenza virus A and B. In addition, there are other viruses like respiratory syncytial virus, coronavirus, adenovirus, which are the other causes of crew. Corticosteroids are the mainstay for the treatment of crew, since they are anti-inflammatory drugs. The best way to treat is. by giving oral or injectable if the child is more sick we can give an injectable corticosteroid like dexamethasone otherwise an oral steroid like prednisolone would suffice if the child is not so sick if the child is sick even oxygen following admission would be required and other supportive measures